Hey, 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 what's going on guys and guys? Troy ATX RC Productions. More importantly, drone and multi-rotor tips, tricks, reviews, and unboxings. And about that, we got the Lux flight controllers last night, or yesterday. We did a video unboxing them, just kind of showing them last night. And I wanted to quickly talk about setting these up because there's been some chatter already. Hugo, my main man from Aerial Visions, and myself have been going back and forth already this morning. I almost started setting one of these up last night, but I stopped myself because I wanted to be kind of sure and kind of think about it on a clear head. And there's just a couple of little things you need to know. Now, I'm, there is a manual for this that you can download, and I definitely suggest it because it does talk about all the different pads and kind of shows you some information on setting up. It also tells you not to disturb the board and blah, blah, blah. Um... And on there, it's kind of hard to understand. It's going to be difficult to see here, possibly. But I'm going to do a video once I actually prep one. But on these, on the bottom here, you have these two oops, solder pad setups that have are very small. And they have three pads on each one. Now, they're labeled. So the top one here is labeled... PPM, and then the middle one is blank, and then the bottom one is SRX for Serial RX. And then you have one that has three pads that says five, and then nothing, and then three. Now, what you have to do is you're going to actually bridge two pads on both of them. You have to bridge on both of them. One of them is the five and the three is the voltage that's going to come out when you connect to your RX pads here. So if you need five volts for your RX, then you need to bridge the middle pad and the five volt pad with a little bit of solder. So what you would do is you'd put a little bit of um, flux on there and then you would solder the two pads together, being careful not to solder the three volt pad. Same thing goes for if you're running PPM or serial RX, like I'm running SBUS, I'm gonna actually solder the middle pad to the lower pad that says SRX. That will connect basically the pads to where the PCB, the PDB inside is running the proper voltage and the proper signal inversion to the main pads where you're going to still connect your RX. So that's it. Hugo, what's up, brother? I was actually about to sit out and do the exact same thing before I go to work because I've been jonesing to get this thing going. I'm really excited to get this Lumineer Lux running, and uh, we're going to drop this first one into a Multirotor Mania 180, and the other one is going to go also in a 180 in the Shuriken by uh, Sasquatch Labs. So stay tuned. Fly safe, fly smart, fly for fun. Fly Lux, man. It's supposed to be the shit. Peace.